Okay, good morning mga kaibigan, mga kababayan. So I'm here today doing uh, inspection and we will be visiting uh, four sites today in my project and I'm uh, with uh, Uncle Steven. Yeah, Uncle Steven is here. So he's, uh, he's a Singaporean and a very good guy. sites today for some uh, inspection okay so this is part of our daily routine conduct inspection in every site in a daily basis so yung po ang buhay natin kayo ng uh, engineer dito sa upper so, nandito na lang po and yun nakasabihay kami ngayon mga kaibigan, mga kababayan so maulan ngayon sa site namin so, so uh, tinanggal ko muna yung high protection ko dahil medyo nagmumoy siya uh, i-share ko lang sa inyo kung paano yung uh, tawag dito yung safety procedure dito sa tunneling works dito sa site namin so isa lang to sa site namin na hinahawakan ngayon And uh, siyempre, alam naman natin na uh, kung nagtatrabaho tayo sa confined space, isa yan sa pinaka mahirap at saka pinaka risky na trabaho. So maraming mga uh, dapat isa alang-alang pa dyan sa safety. So dito sa project natin dito sa Singapore, uh, may kit sila pagdating sa ganyan so authorized personnel lang talaga yung pumapasok dun sa mga confined space kagaya ng tunneling works so later may kita nyo kung paano yung uh, setup nila dun sa uh, entrance and exit para walang uh, unauthorized person yung uh, makapasok kundi yung mga authorized lang so syempre dapat una una para mabigyan ka ng authorization na makapasok ka sa confined space or tunneling dapat certify ka ng government na Singapore pangalawa uh, train ka you, you are also trained uh, to work or to go inside the confined space kagaya ng mga tunneling ngayon syempre sa pag nasa company ka na uh, iniisyo ka nila ng ID na sinisertify ka na pwede kang pumasok sa mga confined spaces kagaya ng tunneling so ayun dito tayo ngayon sa ano sa uh, sa project natin and para ako ninja no? Ayan. so ito yung uh, uh, entrance natin sa tunnel Ayan. so normally, normally we have a uh, uh, watchman inside the uh, entrance exit and this is our guy uh, our watchman uh, I, I'm, yeah, I'm vlogging, vlogging this one vlogging So first we need to write down our name there then together with the ID then as you can see on the tally board uh, we need to put our ID there in one way. So as you can see in the tally board also they monitoring the uh, condition of air sa ito pa. So at yung mga gases they consider that one also. So today I will assign this on this point then later papakita ko sa inyo kung paano yung Uh, mechanism with this uh, entrance exit. So this is my friend. What is your name? Mani. Mani. So this is Mani from India, right? Yeah, yeah. So he's from India. Normally he's the one in charge in uh, entrance exit in the confined space. So now we are here in LS3 and he is the main in charge. So he can always uh, check the timing of the personnel going out and going inside also. He is the attendant. So he's also at Uh, train personnel for doing this job and uh, he's working how many long you're working in Singapore? 13 years. 13 years. Very long already. Very experienced. Okay, so later I will show you how and for the meantime uh, I will cut this video first here. Okay, move away. Thank you. God bless. 
Okay mga kaibigan, mga kababayan, so balot na balot naman tayo. So this time papakita ko sa inyo kung paano nag-work itong uh, ID na inisyo sa atin para sa entrance exit sa confined space. So una, kailangan mo itap doon dahil uh, uh, ano naman siya, uh, bluetooth, bluetooth type siya. So mariregister yan doon sa may tapping point, then pag natapping point mo dyan, Uh, mag-open yung door so yan nakita nyo siya nag-open na siya then kailangan natin pumasok and kailangan natin i-close itong door na to kasi magnetic yan so pag na-close natin yan uh, automatically pwede na natin pindutin yung uh, way in so magbubukas yung another door eto kasi pag hindi natin nasarado yung sa una hindi magbubukas yun kasi ibig sabihin hindi pa siya naka fully close So, kailangan i-close natin yon Then, mapupush ma natin yung button dun sa way in. So, mapubuksan natin yung isa pang gate. So, ganyan yung sistema dito sa uh, tunneling o working in confined space in Singapore. And, kung gusto mo naman lumabas na, mag-outcast, so, kailangan mo na naman i-tap in yung card and i-read dyan. And, pag <clears throat> na-read na siya ng uh, tapping point, so, mag-open yung door and... Uh, kagaya ng una, need to close para mabuksan mo yung another door. So, yun yung uh, safety procedure dito pagdating sa uh, pagpasok mo sa tunnel. So, hindi ka pwede basta-basta pumasok dyan pag wala kang ID or hindi ka authorized. So, yan. Uh, kikita nyo yung confined spaces, mga instruction board dyan. Okay? So, ganito kami sa Singapore, mga kaibigan. And, naman, nabigyan namin kayo ng konting idea about dito sa safety uh, ng ating uh, entrance exit sa tunnel. So, authorized personnel lang talaga yung pwedeng pumasok dyan pag nabigyan ka ng ID. Okay? So, hanggang dito na lang. Abangan nyo pa yung uh, ibang isi-share natin. And, dito, abangan nyo susunod na video. Mabuhay! Boom! Guys, you witness how we go inside the the spine space or the tunneling works so this is uh, how they do the how they ensure the safety uh, going to spine spaces like the tunneling work so later i will uh, share or soon i will share the another part so what's up so for the meantime until here and thank you for uh, your effort and time to watch this video and hoping i i give some idea especially to our kababayan that uh, don't have yet experience in tunneling work. So this is uh, how they see use and how they uh, ensure safety in the tunneling works and uh, confined space work. Okay, see you. Bangan po ang next na part. Mabuhay. Boom. General Loren po. General Loren at your service. Mabuhay po ang service. Boom. Hey hey, Mabuhay. don't forget to subscribe in my YouTube channel. Just click the subscribe button and the notification bells for more video updates. Thank you!